Hello guys, in this video we are going to see the IC4077. It is XNOR gate. Here you can see the input is 0, 0 and we are getting output as 1. If input is 0, 1 then we will get 0 as our output. If our input is 1, 0 then we will get 0 as our output and if the input is 1, 1 then we will get 1 as our output. So this is XNOR gate. So let's get started. CD4077 It is a XNOR IC XNOR This is the symbol of XNOR It will have two input A and B and the output will be Y We can write it as A XNOR B equal to Y or you can write it A XOR B whole bar equal to Y. The truth table will be when both the inputs are equal that is if both the input is 0 and 0 then we will get 1 as output. If these inputs are different then we will get 0. Again if we make this 1 both the inputs are equal then we will have 1 as our output. Now we will see the pin diagram of this IC. It has 14 pins. Pin number 7 is ground and pin number 14 is VCC. I will apply plus 5 volt. This IC has 4 XNOR gate. This is the gate 1, gate 2, gate 3 and gate 4. For the practical we will use gate number 1. The two inputs are pin number 1 and 2 and the output is pin 3. Now we will see the practical circuit. Here is our IC. With pin number 14 we will connect plus 5 volt and with pin number 7 we will connect it to the ground. Pin number 1 and 2 these two are input and with these two we will connect a switch to provide input. The other side of the switch is connected to the plus 5 volt. As it is digital IC so we have to connect pull down resistor. The value of this resistor is 10 kilo ohms. To see the input we are connecting LED and a series resistor with this. The value is 220 ohms. Pin number 3 is output and to see the output we are connecting LED. So this is the simple connection. Now we will see this thing on breadboard. One request please consider to subscribe my channel. This will motivate me to make more videos. Thank you. IC4077 220 ohms resistor 10 kilo ohms resistor and switch. Putting the IC switch A switch B. Pin number 14 is connected to the positive rail. Pin number 7 is connected to the ground with the input pins connecting pull down resistor. One pin of the switch is connected to the positive rail connecting input LED, output LED with the negative pin of the LED connecting 220 ohms resistor and then it is connected to the ground. Switch A is connected to the pin number 1 and switch B is connected to the pin number 2. Pin 3 is connected to the output LED. So this is our connection. Now I am connecting plus 5 volt. Here it is negative and the positive. As you can see our input is same so we are getting 1 as our output. Ok. Now it is different that is 0 1 or 1 0 we will get output as 0. When we make both 1 again we are getting 1 as our output. So today we have seen that if the input of XNOR gate is same then we will get 1 as our output and if the input is different then we will get 0 as our output. So guys this is all for today. I hope you like this video. If so then please like share and subscribe to my channel and if you have any doubt on this then please let me know in the comment section. In the next video I will show you another topic. Till then 
stay happy and i'll see you in the next video thanks for watching